so uh, what happened is that we asked for a pump out because our waste tank was full and what actually happened is the people who came to empty the waste tank probably confused the outlet and they pumped something out or nothing out but not the waste either way the waste tank was and full. ask us if they they called us to let us know that they pumped nothing out no they didn't bother to let us know so we just kept on going along sorry love thinking that ah, we had a pump out everything's fine that wasn't the case it com it overflowed or broke a seal so now we smell our own piss and I'm going to show you what happened in there and it's going to be pretty disgusting. So those who are eating right now, I suggest turn off the video right now. So first of all, before I show you what happened is that I asked for another pump out and then I, the guy arrived and I show him the outlet. I opened it for him and it was already difficult to get it out of there, but we did. And I asked him to please put something on the end that I can use to bring it down here and try to vacuum the piss out because it really stinks. Well, I had this very intimate moment with the guy when I finished the whole process of trying to pump out this thing like Ghostbuster style. And then because the suction wasn't hard enough, that's what she said, uh, there was, yeah, there were piss waves. And it was the first time that I ever had to clean my own piss and I'm embarrassed to say that, but actually proud because it took me 29 years to clean my own piss. And I was trying to suck it out from under the engine and it didn't do it. So it was just freaking waving and it was a, it was disgusting. It's like coming out, it was flowing in. I was like, oh my God, this is horrible and it stinks. I was like, okay, dude, I can't, I can't do this. I was like, it's not happening. So then <clears throat> he turned the machine off and I was handing this device off to him with my own piss on it. So I just had this intimate moment with a complete stranger that I just met and I don't want to do this ever again. Let me show you how this looks. Hold your breath, America. Oh yeah, hold your breath. This is terrible. Never in my life I thought I would have to go for this. So you met me. Oh God. That's the engine, and that's us. No, the floor isn't brown. That is a gallon of piss. Oh come on, it stinks, please. It's, it's sentence. Sometimes it really is better being a woman. America, you might see me throw up. You have no idea how stinky this is. <laughs> if you ever had to smell your own piss for four days, this is how this smells. Luckily, it was pretty locked away, <clears throat> so we really didn't have first hand like I do right now. Meanwhile, in Choco Town, sup, little dude? You don't give a shit about this, do you? Just chilling. That's Choco's bed. It's our bed. And uh, Adam is still working on the piss project. Celebration because what happened after the first half of the video is something we're not proud of. We've done some stuff that we cannot unsee anymore. We went to a store and got a vacuum cleaner and what do you think we did with the vacuum cleaner and with the sea of piss? We, va we vacuumed the crap out of it, literally. So, <laughs> was there, there was piss on the boat, probably on Choco, definitely on us. And oh, then, and then I accidentally put the vacuum on the reverse. Oh, oh yeah. 
and I'm accidentally turned the vacuum on the wrong setting and then it was it started spraying <laughs> piss all over the boat. It was disgusting and we finally did it and I I feel so exhausted, you have no idea. It was so disgusting. And the smell, my god, it still haunts me and all our clothes are they have to be aired out because even though you know they don't smell so bad but they don't smell as good as they used to you know, so i totally deserve this sangria right now I'm not a drinker but i'm drinking tonight and i never want to go through this again i still have ptsd after what happened p with double e still think the you still want to share blame with the marina I, I really can't think about blaming anyone right now. I'm just happy that it's I can over. think about it. It was all their fault. Whatever. 